Hi, everybody. This is Pastor Susan, and welcome to our final day this week of devotions as we're talking about bearing one another's burdens and being community together and finding that abundant life that God calls us to through Jesus Christ. Today, we're going to be talking about the importance of telling others the great God story that is our lives. Telling others the good news. Um, and, you know, I think we've been talking about it all week. Um, but I want to read a passage of scripture to you from Acts chapter 1, uh, which is one that I've committed to memory. Um, and it says this, You shall receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you, and you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem and in Judea and in Samaria and to the uttermost parts of the earth. And, you know, this is a promise that we've been given um, of the Spirit's power to help us to be witnesses. What does it mean to be a witness? Well, maybe you would think about um, being a witness in trial, you know, that you have seen something, you have experienced something, and they want, they want more information. They want eyewitnesses uh, or people who have heard or, I mean, yeah. So you get my drift here. You know, a witness is someone who tells the truth that they have seen and experienced for themselves. And um, this is what, uh, what Luke, who wrote the book of Acts, is saying that, uh, you know, that Jesus, you know, he's saying as he's being ascended into heaven, you're going to be my witnesses. This is up to you guys now. I've been here, I'm going to send my spirit, and when I send my spirit, you all do the work. You all do the work. Do it together. Do the work. And you know, I think a lot of times we don't do the work. What is doing the work? Doing the work is making ourselves available to receive the spirit. And so part of it is praying for the spirit to give us discernment and wisdom and filling one of the things that I do every morning um, as I'm getting ready for the day and having devotions and praying, I'm asking God to fill me up again, fill me up to overflowing so that not only will I be able to be present to other people, but I will also be able to witness to my faith in God. Um, Perhaps that is what we, the most important thing that we can do is to share the good news that we love God and that God loves us and God loves every human being on the planet. Um, I think sometimes we just forget that that's, that's our job. Um, how, do we, how do we grow in the church? Well, we tell others about what God is doing in our own lives and that being part of a community of faith to, to form faith every day and to serve boldly and to welcome radically, those are our core values, can only come through the power of the Holy Spirit that comes to the church in community. And so my prayer for you and for me this week as we are ending this week um, is to once again encourage you, if you are able in person, to come in person to worship, to come and be a part of community, to come and th consider what God is saying to you and the good news that God wants you to share with your family, with your friends, with people that you will come in contact with. Um, I know uh, I think about this a lot. My, my husband um, has the opportunity to see thousands of people, and he gets that opportunity to witness to his faith as well as entertain. Um, you know, I, I get that, and uh, do not discount his ability to share the good news and make an impact on the world. You and I may not see a thousand people a day. We might not see a thousand people in a year. But God has those people that we are involved in with our lives, that we have that opportunity to witness to the power and the love and the grace that God has given to us to share that with others. That's our responsibility. It's our job. And God will equip us as we come together and as we get involved. So come. If you can come in person this Sunday, come to worship. Come to be with us 
so that we together can grow into being that force for good, force for love, force for compassion um, in Jesus' name. You know, there's that wonderful song, They'll Know We Are Christians By Our Love, that we'll work with each other side by side, that we will be together for the sake of the gospel. Maybe so in your life, maybe so in mine. And hopefully I'll see you Sunday if you're around. If you can't be there, please join us online and know that we love you and we pray God's blessings. Amen and amen.